<sighs> Akeem, what are you still doing awake? It's nearly noon. Still building your palace? Oh, uh, sorry for the noise, Great Mother. I'm almost finished. <sighs> so I see. I wanted to be ready, so when I finally find the magic I need, <laughs> I can make it real. Hmm, magic. Then, I can find my princess and live happily ever after. Oh no. So, this is your dream. Kianja, not this To leave again. me behind and find your true love? It's not that I don't appreciate what you've done for me. You've been the only mother I've really ever known. I wouldn't dream of abandoning you. Not like my parents did to me. But I want to see the world and become a brave warrior and become a prince one day. <laughs> just like in the stories you used to tell me. But those are just fairy tales, Akeem. They're not real. True love isn't promised, even with enough magic. But you found Aradegi. Wait, well... Maybe I, I can make it all real myself, too. Maybe with enough time. Maybe if you make me like you... Akeem, we've discussed this. You're still just a child. You cannot become a vampire until you're older. But why? I'm ready now. <sighs> Akeem, please, not today. What more do I need to learn? What more is there to know? Well... I've been too young to turn for nearly 20 years now. When will you trust me? It's my only wish, Kianja. Akeem, my darling, you can't see it now, but if you were to have this wish granted, that beautiful palace you have built will become your tomb. You could never enjoy the sunshine through its windows, or taste of the delicate meat roasting in its cooking fires. You will live to see it crumble to dust in time. Your subjects will grow to fear the dark shadows you cast upon its doors every night. No. My people will not fear me. I will fight for them. And I'll feed them. I will protect them from our enemies. I'll even put silver in my eyes. Like you. And become a creature of the night. <laughs> Akim, you poor boy. And who will take care of you? I'll get a familiar. Ah, a familiar. And who will protect your kingdom? From you. You have never endured true thirst, Akeem. You have never heard the blood-curdling screams of your prey. I know, I know, How the foul jump. taste of your victim's life coils inside you like a snake that's trapped in a pit until you're nearly sick to your stomach. But you don't dare give a drop back. You've already told me this before. You have never known endless loss and death the way I have. Oh, Kianja. These things you seek in life can only be built one brick at a time. Ah. <sighs> So, why even make me your familiar if you won't fledge me? Just to trap me here and be your little servant forever? Is that my calling in life? To slowly waste away with you in this dark little hole in the desert you call a home? I made you my familiar because you asked me to. Your young sister needed medicine to escape death, and I could procure it, yes. But you could have stolen it yourself. You didn't need my help from what I saw you doing in those streets. But you asked me to help in exchange for this new life. You stalked me to no end. <laughs> Do you now regret our blood oath? Ah. Do you resent that scar in the palm of your calloused hand? I only wish you could understand me. How lonely I've become. Hmm. With only these tools and these infinite errands and your silly fairy tales to keep me company. Akeem. You have not experienced true loneliness the way a vampire can. There are so very few who have survived it. I understand you better than anyone alive, I do. Ugh. But you are not ready. I am ready. You are just afraid to turn me. Yes. Into something else. You are tired of my fairy tales, oh. yes? Then here is the truth, my little one. I say this because I love you more than anything in this world. If you were to turn before you were ready, you will never grow older, older or, or wiser, wiser. Yes, I know. no matter how long you age. You will relive every day in the same body forever. No gray hair, uh. no wrinkles, no true wisdom, only the stinging memories. Well, maybe I'm already wise enough. My name is Akeem, after all. And your sense of pain will never dull, and the soreness of constant regeneration is unending and merciless. The living venom inside you will insist upon your suffering. Once you've fully turned, it will not let you go, as hard as you try. 
It will grip your mind before you've even finished the thought. You must obey it. Well, I'm strong. And I... I can be made stronger by it, like you. Akeem, you complain of servitude, but stand so readily to trade one master for another. It keeps you alive as long as you fulfill its own dark will to survive. And your cup will never be full, Akeem. You will be trapped in this life as a predator until there is not one drop of blood left on this earth. And I assure you, my love, the venom will have you squeeze it from the stones. Time is nothing. Worthless. No merchant nor judge can barter you for it. A day feels like just a moment. A millennium, just a decade. But the hurt and this loneliness that you feel today will never fade. Which is why I must find my princess, and we will rule together forever, and live happily ever after, with many children of our own. Children I would never deny happiness to. Oh, come now, Akeem. I have never once denied you anything. Ugh. And do not mock me. You know you cannot make children as a vampire. The venom would kill it in her womb. But, Kianja, how do you know that for sure? But, because... Because I have lived long enough to know Akeem. Well, I will never give up, Mother. I will do this, with or without you. I will become a prince one day. I know you will. And you're right. I'm sorry, Akeem. I chose to make you my familiar because I see greatness in you and a good, loyal, loving heart. You have a strong spirit. And who am I to destroy your dream? I will not stand in your way. Wait, you mean you're- Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah, uh, when the time Wahoo. comes. All right. And not a sunrise before. Of course, when I'm... When we are ready. <laughs> Thank you, mother. Oh, you're welcome, my little prince, with his head in the clouds, <sighs> but his heart always in the right place. So, uh, when are we leaving for Rome? I want to be finished before we leave. There must be magic there, don't you think? We will leave very soon, and we shall see about this magic of yours. Hmm. What's there anyways? The beginning of our new lives. Rest now, Prince Akeem.